Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel, Ekham Family. My name is Mary Ann, and it is almost 4 o'clock in the afternoon, and I'm going to harvest some blueberries in our plants. Yesterday, we did harvest three gallons of blueberries from two plants, and today, this afternoon, we have uh, two more plants need to be picked because the blueberries are already very ripe some are very ripe already and let's check how many gallons we will get today I'm very excited yesterday was three gallons I was awesome I was very nice harvest so let's go please don't forget to subscribe comment below the video hit the like button and let's check the blueberry plants everyone I am I am here next to the plants and this plant is about maybe eight year old these plants are and there are only two plants in this area here uh, the other two plants that we did yesterday we did harvest that plants there, there are two of them in there uh, it was three gallons and there are more in there, still green, so we will uh, harvest more of that maybe in a couple of weeks from now. But this one, this is I'm going to where I'm going to harvest the blueberries in here. Look at the blueberries. That's so pretty. I'm going to take a photo of that. There we go. Alright, let's start doing it. Wow, some are really big. Like the size of... Well, I don't know what size. But this is big, look. Let me taste it. Mmm, yummy. Very sweet. And my daughter wants to make a blueberry cobbler, so we'll do it tomorrow. Uh, this morning, we were getting ready to make blueberry cobbler but guess what when i check my pantry i don't have sugar so we'll get some sugar first and i will make blueberry cobbler tomorrow so maybe i can take a video of making blueberry cobbler so let's see I, I think I found a recipe that I like about blueberry cobbler, so I'm going to try that tomorrow. I'm slow here because I don't want, I try not to drop all the, you know, a lot of blueberries to the ground. So it's just slow and easy. I'm not sure how much is that blueberries in the I mean at the store I'm not sure how much I'm not sure if it's a per pound or per pint I don't know but we have quite here quite a few wow then look at that that's pretty blueberry blueberries <laughs> very good well I need to keep going uh, I just harvest a few in there and then see you later I will see you how much I'll be able to pick this okay see you then So let's get busy picking blueberries. I 
and this this blueberries this year we did not uh, fertilize we forgot to fertilize this year and there is we don't spray on our blueberry plant so no spray here and no fertilizer this year too but uh, last year we did fertilize the plants look at this is big and very sweet well I come from the Philippines but I'm, I don't know if blueberries grow in the Philippines. I think maybe too hot. But they are delicious. They say uh, the darker the color of the fruit or the vegetable, the better it is more nutritious. Huh? I guess it is more nutritious because it's uh, dark in color. I don't know what this color is. that purple or dark blue? Maybe blue because it's blueberries. Very good. Right now it's 83 outside here, 83 degrees. It's nice. The sun is out and it's nice. I like it, 83 degrees. See you later because I I really need to be busy picking the blueberries or else my bucket won't fill up. Here. Say hi please. Hi. Can you wave your hand? The sun is so bright. Yeah. Let's see if she can fill up that bucket. That's a one gallon ice cream container. It's family size. Oh family size, okay. Yep. That that we harvest. So far, I did this. One and a half gallons. So pretty. Yeah. Wait. Her. I mean, one of our two of our chickens escaped from our coop. Like they're like like six months old or something. Um, they were young, like in a really good age, but they weren't laying eggs right now, or yet. Bless you! Um, and one of them got attacked by a fox, because a fox was there just today, and tried to attack her, and then she ran to the patio, the fox followed her, and then she banged on the patio door. And mom was there watching a video, so then she went and looked out and saw the chicken wanting to come inside. But then she looked out and then saw the fox, and she chased the fox, so she saved that chicken's life. <laughs> yeah, she was chicken's life. Yeah, well, very big. Um, like, she's like three months old or a little bit younger, like a little bit younger yeah but you're young young she's like the youngest of our flock so she has more orange in here. so that's probably gonna be it so bye everyone we just get done picking blueberries for now because i have to go inside and make a blueberry smoothie yeah i have to make blueberry smoothie because i promised to them that i'm going to make it and then this is what I've got, two gallons.
and maybe there is more uh maybe uh, a gallon more in there of blueberries and there are still a lot of green blueberries in there so i think there will be a second harvest for a week or two so thank you everyone thank you for watching our video please don't forget to subscribe it's free uh, comment and please like the video thank you everyone god bless take care how's the blueberry smoothie it's okay what do you mean it's okay that's the blueberries we just picked outside um. it's a little bit tart right yeah that's a taste of blue blueberry i like it and it tastes like the Cabbage smoothie or cabbage? Do you know what's the taste of a cabbage? Uh, if I will make, you would you have some more or no? Next time. Probably. Probably okay. That's a good idea. I like a blueberry smoothie. It's not very sweet though. Tarty taste.